to another exciting and riveting episode of Watching Paint Dry. Viking Last couldn't be here today, so I, Michael Love, Vigia Last, that sounds like I was saying vagina, but I wasn't, I swear. Now, you know what? I can't see. <sighs> Guys, just kidding! It was me the whole time! Hi, everybody! Welcome to Watching Paint Dry. I'm Viking Last, uh, and this is the show where we paint and repair the mechs that are destroyed by me on Fridays during Death from Above, our battle tech game, which if you've never seen, you should, because it's fantastic. That my hair is looking pretty fucking awesome right now. Also, check this sweet ass hoodie out. I got this in uh, the little boy section of Target. And it fits me, go figure. I got a big butt and yet this somehow fits me. Hi! <laughs> Hi Lady K, it's a moon rule, sticking with you. What? Michelangelas. Michelangelas, it works! Look, Michelangelo was my favorite Ninja Turtle growing up. He was the best, and once I wrote him a love letter saying that we should go skateboarding and eat pizza one day, and I got a letter back saying we should, totally should cat one bunga. So Mikey and I forever. Hey, Ardensk Empire! Commissioner Cowl to duck rabbit wombat. Genova Plus with all my, all my intros. How is everybody? I'm actually gonna take this off because I'm all warm now because I'm excited about painting and everything and mechs. And holy shit, did you catch the freaking season finale last week of Death From Above? So good, if you haven't seen it yet, you really should. It was really, really, really fucking good. Like that show has just gotten better and better and better. What an awesome way to end the season. And in the meantime, they announced that we're gonna be doing Renegades, which I'm really excited about. The enemy from about two weeks ago, the Anvil, the French dude, ha ha ha. He is gonna be the GM of Renegades and I'm super excited about it because he was very quick and witty. And I've been chatting with him, uh, I've been chatting with him about the mechs to paint and they used to play Battletech and so they're very knowledgeable, so it's going to be an excellent, excellent, excellent show. Oh, I got things in my eye, isn't that fun? No, it's not, but that's okay. It's not painting yet. Okay, so, today, my guest is you, chat. I have new glasses, so I can't like take them off and do my things as much as I would like, but that's okay, because I can see. I enjoy seeing so much, which is great. Today, <laughs> So today's question is, will April come out of her shell? And I guess the answer is yes, because it's gone now. It's totally gone now. I'll put that back on once I once I cool down. I'm just excited and running around sweaty. I got here like five minutes ago. Woo! Yeah! My new specs. Dude, they're great, because I can see, and it's fantastic. I love them. The finale was off the hook. It was, wasn't it, Wolf Gamer? Oh my god. Chat is always the best guest. Chat, I love having you as a guest, because we get to hang out a bit. And yes, it's good when we've got other guests on here and all that stuff, but I really do truly enjoy being able to have a chance to talk, chat with you guys here on the Hyper BG channel. I do. This, this is very much what it's like on my streams, so it's nice to be able to get a chance to hang out with you guys in the same way that I'm used to and accustomed to. Oh, would you look at that. All right, so, rules! Oh wait, do I get a cup? <gasps> I have a cup, guys. Oh, yes. No, you keep that cup. Oh, okay. Oh, cool. I've never had a cup on this show before. All right, so we got a couple things going on today. We saw Frank and Mac. Does that mean we have to uh, cataract and assemble? Yes. Um, we've got a couple things going on here. Um, first off, we have the flipping grasshopper. Oh my god, wait, wait, wait. Because of the camera and where it's at, it looks like these are my legs. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> so this is the grasshopper. Like look at the look at the gams on this thing. Like, my god. Look at this. This is kind of absurd. Oh my god. Ooh, leggy leggy Lucy over here. Oh, I gotta show off all my sweet ass legs. Oh, would you look at my calves? I don't work out. I just happen to be genetically blessed. Mmm. Yes, that's right. <laughs> oh, lady. Okay. How many legs did we get? We got two. One left, one right, so we're okay. Uh, so today what we're gonna do is I'm going to quickly prime, I'm gonna quickly prime this grasshopper while I chat with you lovely people. And then we're gonna do Frank and Mac. Uh, so we need to try and put together a Mac. Um, like, it's gotta be put together of a bunch of pieces, so 
I've got I've got a shit ton of mech pieces and parts over here. I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I've never had to do this before. Uh, so we gotta work on Franken mech today. Uh, prime the grasshopper, and if I get time, uh, I need to make a hatchet to go into the hand of one of the mechs. So in the meantime, I'm gonna show you what I did last night. The Atlas is gonna be showing up. Oh baby. So these are the colors they requested, and I'm really excited about them because uh, this actually looks really good. And I was really pleased with the way it came out. So I will be... Yeah, I need to, I do need to weather that a bit. Um, so we got the trebuchet as well, which they wanted a green. This I definitely need to add on to a little bit today. Um, I'll probably do that after the stream though, just because it's more fun to watch me make a franken mech than watch me do, uh, do the stuff I do every week. Okay, so let's, let's paint this real quick. Missing a bow, a lot of bowel there. Might be a butt problem. Are we missing some butts? I don't see what. Commissioner Gahal would like some uh, would like some butts. So I do believe, chat, you could help him out there. Please give your butts unto him. Give them unto him, and let it be known that the butts are here for all and all. There you go, Rabbit Wombat. He's got you covered. Excellent. Okay, so let's quickly do this. Yes. Oh, I like. I love it when there's a nice uh, variety of bits. That's always really good. Should we get on Twitter and ask? Oh wait, and ask uh, the new team to request the correct colors. You know, beige and plaid. No. Bad Genova Plus. Bad you. <laughs> oh you. You tend to do a better painting job when you actually see the model from more than three inches away. What? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? It, you know, it is nice to have these larger mechs too. Like, um, small mechs are difficult to work with, so. Uh, they are quicker to paint, that is true, yes, but, um, oh right, I've got shitty black paint. That's right, I forgot. Um, Someone needs to remind me I need to order, we need to order more black paint. Rye Rye, we need more paint. Just just an FYI. No, we don't like things being beige. Oh wait, do we have the potato? I wanna show you guys the potato. I was really proud of this. So, <laughs> we finally caved and we just drilled. Yeah, because I didn't get to show you guys this on camera. So we drilled the leg for the Thunderbolt and so it's literally got two left legs, but it works. Who gives a shit? And uh, it's, I was told to paint it like a baked potato. So here's the butter. What's a baked potato without butter? Yeah, exactly, that's what I thought. Stupid, that's what it is. Oh, the new glasses. Oh, Mortis, I get it now, sorry. Yeah, I forgot how blind I was until I, uh, Got my new specs. I've actually adapted to them pretty quickly. I think my body was just like, finally, oh my God, April. We've needed to see for so long. Okay, there. A reminder, you need black paint. Thank you, Parvis. Rainbow glitter. Mmm. Yes, an actual Franken mech. We need, we need to, we need to put together a mech. And I don't even know how we're gonna do that. <gasps> Severin. Thank you for following. Nice to have you here. Welcome to the Yojimbo. Dude, I'm really good at making everybody hungry. Does Viking underscore last have a guest today or is it Bidoof? Uh, I don't think Bidoof's gonna be able to make it, so we've got Chat as our, our lovely guest here today. This paint sucks. Holy shit, this paint sucks. This paint is like so bad. Oh my gosh. I regret everything. Absolutely everything. Damn it. Yeah, so we're out of the P3. So the P3 paint works so much better than any other paint we've had. So I've got some water down here. That'll help. I can see clearly now that the rain has gone. Um, yeah, it is kind of sad actually. I can see all the obstacles in my way. What? All the obstacles in my way? But what if the obstacle is the way? Huh? Tell me. What if the obstacle is the way? 
Yes, that is a book that I'm going to be reading on the plane tomorrow. <laughs> Genovo! Which thingy on my wrist? Am I allowed to show this? I'm showing this. Oh my god, I already got paint on it. Thumper of pride! Hey, let me see your thumper pride in chat right now. Thumpers, let me see your pride. Sound off! Anytime someone knocks, we should just have everyone spam the thumper bunnies. Yes. No one likes Badoof, they can't do anything useful. Okay, when did Badoof come into play? Because like, I watched Pokemon XY, and I saw Badoof only once. There it is, look at that. Look at all the bunnies! Oh, I love bunnies! Oh, they're so cute! Oh my god, I love the thumper. Look at that. I forget who designed that rabbit, but whoever did needs like so much credit because that's such a wonderful shaped rabbit. Your bunny has lovely angles and curves. I don't have pride, only moderate self-loathing. Derp to derp to derp, Mortis. All right, we're pretty much done with this part and I can move on to just painting the legs and we can move on to Frank and Mac. Oh, Mortis, that thing's so cute. I love that little rainbow sheep. Yeah, thumpers. So who here's going to TwitchCon, huh? I leave tomorrow morning. <gasps> I can't believe I leave tomorrow morning. I can't believe it's like happening already. I'm just like... Uh, <laughs> I can't believe, I can't believe it's this weekend. Malika designed it? Damn, Malika done good. It's hard making icons and all that, all that jazz, that junk. That's the best paint job yet for the Atlas? You think so, Hippie? Thank you. You know, I actually have not gotten to paint the Atlas in a badass way. So that is very true, actually. I think that maybe, this may be the best Atlas paint job we've had, but because um, the storyline's not requiring it to look silly in any way. I'm also very curious to see how the Renegades uh, show goes, because it's going to tie in it's gonna tie in with uh, our Marauders uh, at the end. And I'm curious to see how it goes with a, a, different, a different GM and different lead characters. I will still be mechacutioning in the background, don't you worry. You can't get rid of last that easily, nice try. DJ Blue, hi! My flight is, oh also guys, if you're not following DJ Blue, do yourself a favor and hit that follow button. Do it, do it, do it. How are you, DJ? Uh, so I leave tomorrow morning at 11.45? Something like that. Oh, you arrive at 1.35. Uh, so I'm arriving at 2.30? 2.30. Dude, I have so much to do. Ah, oh, I have to send an email. Hold on. A reminder, in one hour, send email to Jeff about luggage. Thank you. Okay. Uh, if Zach is ever the executioner, there usually isn't a mech left over to fix or paint. I've noticed that. So like, okay, man, when I am the mech executioner, I am very aware of the, the, the work that has to go into painting it and repairing it. So I know the proper ways to uh, destroy things and, so that I can fix them and reuse them later. Zach don't give a fuck. Zach just goes and destroys it. And like the thing is, like these things are expensive, so I do my best to try and save them. But if Zach's really like, if Zach's gonna destroy them, then that's fine. It's not on my ass. Uh, I mean, the other thing is, like you know, if Mitch comes over and decides to go smash and smash them, that's fine too. <laughs> I actually really like it when I get help. Do you guys like how, like, when Cam died the other day, like they all came out and they all wanted to smash it with a hammer? <laughs> that was fun. Wait, 6 freaking a.m.? Ew. Oh! Oh, I don't have any on me, but... Oh! Selgeld! Thank you for the follow. Good to have you. 
Welcome to the Yajimbo, hanging out with the Thumpers. Peyton the Max, doing the things and the stuff. Send email to Jeff about luggage, yes. Max go boom. Our Renegades will face off against the Marauders. Let the fan theories begin, oh my god. Oh, I wonder if that's good. They, they didn't even tell me anything, so I don't know. They never teach, tell them execution or nothing. It's kind of annoying. But I the, show up and I break things. Yeah, I show up and I break shit, and then I show up again and I fix the shit that I broke. Just, uh, you know, how it's done. Uh, oh shit, I lost track of, wait, girl. Oh, DJ Blue, yeah, I know, Friday's show was fucking amazing. It was so good. So, so good. Four hour later in San Francisco? Oh shit. Oh, that's crazy. That is a very long layover. Anyway, I don't have any, oh, I do have some I could show, actually. I just knocked the camera. I did? Oh, uh, you did. Oh, it's like an earthquake that's very slow moving. <laughs> anyway, uh, so I'm gonna move this camera. So if anyone here is going to TwitchCon, come find me because I'm gonna have stickers. Uh, and just a heads up, I won't get into it all ranty. Um, but I have a really shitty immune system, so I get sick very easily. So I won't be giving out the standard hugs. I'll be giving out special Viking Lass hugs. These are uh, stickers that I, I actually drew and designed. So those are my hugs. You can come get, I've only got 100 of them. So come get a hug. And then also, come get some butts. Yeah, get some butts, some butts, some hug butts, some butt hugs. No, no actual butt hugs, but hug butts, baby. There you go. Encourage you to finally subscribe. Damn, Imp, yeah, look at that. You got yourself a little thumper right there now. Good for you. Good to have you as on the team. Stickers! Uh, yeah, so please don't, don't, don't feel bad if I decline a hug. I just have a very bad immune system and my health insurance has been shitty, so I can't get sick. Also, my work uh, ends up paying the price when I get sick nowadays. Self-employment! So please don't be offended and come take a sticker and be happy about it and come draw and hang out with me. That's what I really want at TwitchCon is I want to hang out with people. <gasps> Thank you, DJ Blue! That'd be amazing, yes! Yes, go hug other people instead of me, for me. I would I would highly appreciate that, I really would. Butts and hugs and butts and hugs and butts and hugs and butts and hugs. It's a new Boots and Pants song. I'm all for it, excellent. When one butt touches another butt, that is called the moon landing. No, it's not. Oh wait, no, I'm thinking of something else. We're not gonna get into it because this channel ain't that dirty. <laughs> You like hugging butts? Oh, no TwitchCon for you, Malfunct. Oh, also, hi, Malfunct. How are you? Aw. Hey, Born. Thanks, Born. So what I want to do is I want to make the stickers con exclusive. So we'll see how this year's goes. Um, but every con, I would like to design a different set of stickers. And and this way, it's just like, cause I, cause I've actually had people kind of feel bad when I've, when I've said I'd rather not get a hug, give a hug. And, and again, it's just like, blame the people who have ruined it, and then also blame my immune system for being shitty. But I would love to have this way, you know, I can help prevent anyone from feeling like it's them, uh, when it's truly, in fact, because of other people, and also my shoddy, my shoddy body. Um, but. It'd be really fun to have like kind of like collectible stickers, but you can only get them from me at cons by not hugging me. Elbows all the way, man. I will elbow the hell out of you. Uh, yeah, so I've already packed. Dude, this morning was insane for me. <laughs> yes, that is dirty. <laughs> I fire blind, man. Can we get a DJ Blue uh, mohawk wig for circuit hugs? Yes! Oh my God! Oh my God, DJ Blue, you should let me draw on you. You should let me draw a last hawk on you. That would be really funny. Did we wear your trivia hop ears? Mm -hmm. uh, that makes sense, Malfunct. That's that's how it was for uh, Dragon Con for me. I really wanted to go to Dragon Con, but I can't afford it. And it, it, I can't afford it, and then it also just doesn't make sense for me to go. Like, Dragon Con would be straight up pleasure. It wouldn't be business at all. So uh, there's just, until I can start making extra money, I, I can't do stuff like that anymore. We <laughs> when one butt touches another butt, we usually charge extra for that. 
That's good, you know, getting your money's worth. That's important. Uh, putting five on eBay as an auction might be good for us internationals. Ooh. Ooh. There's a suggestion I put on the Discord. Hyper RPG patches. <gasps> Ooh. That would be something worth uh, messaging Emily about. Um, where they could maybe have that in the merch store later on down the line. Because they're super busy right now here. Like, again, I just want to remind you guys how much that how hard these people work here and also how much of a huge help you guys are and what you guys do for this studio. You you are the show, by the way. Without you, without the thumpers, this would be YouTube. And we we don't want that. Yeah, not even. Like the the lore, the best part of Twitch is the live interactions with the chat. So thank you guys again, as always. We're always grateful and thank you to our thumpers. Thump of pride, baby. So, uh, so remind Emily about that because that actually would be cool. And I do have a jacket which I can start putting patches on myself. So I would be interested in one of those as well. Oh, DJ Blue is super, super fun. Shaving my head so you can draw on it. <gasps> I will totally draw on your head. No, DJ, if you guys don't know DJ Blue, that would be amazing. April, April, come to San Diego. I'm waiting. <laughs> You're already there. Oh, also, uh, Puck, can you host for me? I didn't get a chance to, unless it already is. I don't always remember. Today has been fucking insane. So last night I went to go to bed. I was up late doing work and stuff and it was about 2 a.m. which, you know, that's that's, that's a, kind of like a normal time for me to go to bed because I can wake up by 10 and still get shit done. Um, so I go to go to sleep and I'm laying there and then suddenly bink, anxiety kicks in. And I'm one of those people who tends to get anxiety before they go on a trip somewhere, especially TwitchCon, because TwitchCon is a huge deal. So I was like, shit, and my anxiety just started kicking in and I was like, fuck it. And I, I took I took a bit of Xanax, to because that's what I need, otherwise I'll go into a panic attack, which is more fun. No, it's not. So those make me sleep a lot, and it made me sleep past my alarm. So instead of waking up at 10, I ended up waking up at 12.30, and I had like two hours to get ready. It was horrible. It was absolutely horrible. So as I was rushing to get ready this morning, I finished packing my suitcase and as I was zipping up one side of it, the fucking suitcase broke. So I had to repack everything and find, well I tried one suitcase and it was, uh, or it's just a double bag. I tried a double bag, it was too small and then I had to pack a bunch of shit and burr, burr, burr. Ugh! So, um, and then I was forgetting things and then I just had all sorts of crazy shit go on today. And uh, thank you guys to anyone who retweeted my, uh, thank you to anyone who retweeted my, whatchamacallit, um, my tweets about my flash sale for TwitchCon. Thank you so much, you guys. It, it really helped a lot. I really, really appreciate it. And all just everything. You guys are amazing. <gasps> DJ, no! I can't do the thing. I'm gonna try it though. I can't do it. I can't. You, only you can do this, Jack, Shimmy. You're so good at it. Also, if you're not following DJ Knight, what the hell? Go follow him. He's he awesome. Been out chat all day long. He has? What you been doing in chat, Mr. DJ Blue? I mean, DJ Knight. Oh my god, there's two DJs in here. I'm so confused. Bye, Lady K. See you later. Okay, cool. We've got this basically primed up with shadow colors. Let's get to the good shit. Franken Mac! Oh, I'm like not like. I feel, I feel weird not being centered. I don't, I think you are. No, 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 no. I, I mean, me, I, it was me, I moved on the table because I am very EDD. Oh, DJ Blue. I mean, DJ Nate, God damn it, this is gonna confuse the fuck out of me. Sorry. <laughs> Look, I tried, okay. Um, what did I ask? Oh, are you already down to Cali? And by the way, I love your mohawk. It looks so good. We're gonna have to bump hawks when I see you. It'll be so nice. Yeah, worst part of anxiety is the 14 hour naps. Yeah, that is the fucking worst. Oh no, Arrow. Well, hello at least. Okay, let's take a quick old sippy. <sighs> Hydration, key to life. Mmm, it's delicious and lovely and wonderful. Okay. So we got that done. Let's get this Frankenmech thing going on. 
I uh, actually made a bit of a mess here, so I should probably grab myself like another thing to. Did someone say you can get out of your hole? Go back in your hole, Rai Rai. Ah, this is the rabbit hole. Ow! <laughs> oh no, did I miss Viking sales, Genova? It's a uh, so the the TwitchCon sale was for anyone who was going to TwitchCon. Wait, where's my thing? That's right here. The TwitchCon sale was for anyone going to TwitchCon. Uh, it's basically free shipping, along with a free print, and butt stickers, which is exciting. Here, let's see if I can make things not fall over. Ready? Woo! Points. Yeah, we we are. Uh, look, dude, we're 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 capped on DJs right now. We can't have any more. No more DJs here. Are you leaving in the morning? Ah. <laughs> yeah, don't you dare keep moving the camera, because then I'm gonna have to keep moving. The next thing you know, I'm gonna be off the table. That'll be horrible. Okay, so Frankenmech. I think I would like to use the uh, hunchback here as my. Oh, there's what's left of the ogre. I think I want to use the hunchback as the base of it. Ooh, we're gonna have to fill those holes in. Giggity. Holy hole, Batman! Aww. Aww, there's so many, D the DJs are, are combining their powers to be one giant mega DJ! Okay, Frank and Mech. Um, I don't even know where his other little arm is, which would be handy. That would be nice, but whatever. Okay, so, <laughs> so this is from the Jenner. So we can put the Jenner's legs onto, well, there's one Jenner leg. Oh my God, dude, dude, it's like the guy who goes to the gym and never works out his lower body and just the upper. Okay, let's put, oh, I have an idea. So. Oh, carpal tunnel, you son of a bitch. We have any more pieces over here? I'm still here, I promise. La 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 la. Ooh, I found more pieces. Okay, good. Um, what? Okay. So, it would be really cool to have it where it's like, we got the mech here, and they, uh, okay, uh, the, the, you can say that to me. It's a secret. It's a so secret? Oh, wait, remove it by like Dremel it off? Sure. And we just have an extra AC20. I won't say no to that. You know where we can put that AC20? In his crotch? On an Irby. <gasps> AC20 Irby. <clears throat> like it's gonna shoot and it's gonna fly back. DJ Knight. Oh wait, what do we got? Ship it, ship away, what? Oh, I can't. Look, I grew up in a household where, uh, like a family that sells shipping materials. So I hate the term ship it. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. Because it just makes no sense to me. I keep thinking everyone's talking about packing peanuts. But I'm like, that's, why is this a thing? I don't know. Why is she frankenmecking? Because that's just what they asked of me. All right. Um. So, I don't know. I've never franken mechs before. This is very... All right, so we're gonna take this Marauder. I don't know, like, is the is the franken mech gonna be long-term? <gasps> Look at that! Check that shit out, that works. That actually works really well. We should get the Dremel out. I wanna take this off. Rai Rai, can you bring me the Dremel, please? Dremel, please! <laughs> if an Irby could mount an AC-20, it would spin like a, jo a jousting target every time it fired. So what I imagine is if, if an Irby had an AC-20 on it, its legs would have this way to like clamp down into the ground and kind of lock in, so that when it shot, it would like be grounded properly and wouldn't fly back. Also, I'd have better aim about that. Love boat it? Yeah, I'll take love boat it, that's fine. Please jumble off. Please don't dremel off the hunchback's hunch. 
But I'm gonna, because I got Rye right here. I got all the fun stuff. Yeah. This is yes. how we make the mechs, right? Ah! Yes, just, Fixed it. just like that. We're gonna need these then. Definitely. All right, we're gonna dremel off the hunch. Deal with it, folks! Look, dude, check it out from the Marauder. Oh, that looks sick! It like fits, so I'll dremel this off. Yeah, just pop that bad boy off. Who needs an AC-20? Fuck that. Let's do this. I kind of like wish one day we can just make like a spider mech and it's just like eight oh, legs. Oh, we wanted to make a tripod. We wanted to make- A tripod? We really wanted to make a tripod. I got Emily glaring at me. What's up? No, not you. Oh, okay. Is it's that not me? me? No. No, the ceiling. She's glaring at the ceiling. This is not glaring. This is concentration She's to figure out what's- Emily, you know, there's like- Is it, this, like this, this isn't on. I think that might be out. I found a new secret room in the rabbit hole today. I'll That's, tell you about it. Oh, this is so funny. He's like trying to plug things in. <laughs> <laughs> ah, they're giving me power tools, guys. This is how we do it. This is there's how we dremel. Da -da 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 -da. Actually, I want gloves because when you dremel this shit, it hurts. It fucking hurts. Yeah, when you cut your finger off, it hurts. Oh, 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 I got goosebumps right now. No, like, cause like, so what happens is the plastic dremels off and it burns. <gasps> it burns <gasps> a lot. So uh, I'm usually not vocal about it, but last time on the show I was because it really hurt. <laughs> oh baby, let's do this. Uh, I'll be able to check Twitter later. You have the power! All right, let's take, there's some gunk on here. We need to get off of the Dremel tip. And then we can crack this baby off. Oh yeah, let's do this. Andy Pants, the Soiler product placement. You give me free shirts to wear, I will wear them. <laughs> so hot it actually melted the plastic and there's like a puddle of plastic this is crazy all right here we go oh wait i'm sorry i'm gonna do this i need to do this right oh wait can i actually have this on underneath that would be that would be no most nice I can. Excellent. Turtle's gotta be safe, yo. Okay. Turtle power!
much. Uh, that's probably because I was busy doing some awesome dremeling. Thank you so much, dude. Ever consider a hacksaw one of the ones for maddening preps? Uh, we haven't considered much in this channel because I don't know what I'm doing. You know, I'm just a turtle with a sweet bandana and a hammer. Hey! Bud Zelda, it's getting foggy in here. Thank you for the follow. I know you're following for the dremeling, for the sweet, sweet dremeling. Dude, like that Dremel is making it so hot in here that it's melting the plastic. It's kind of crazy. I can smell it. You can smell it? You can smell the sweet, sweet creation. <gasps> Fellow Arena! Eight months in a row! Resub hype! Resub hype! Thank you so much for your resub! And thanks for resubbing during my show. <gasps> this is for you, Phil Arena! Foggy. That was gross. Yeah, burnt hair. yeah welcome to uh, the life of a executioner. Okay, I stopped. I stopped. Blood dry. <laughs> oh, I like that. That should be like the after show that happens. Watching blood dry. Oh my god, this thing is fucking. It's so solid. It's like killing me. Hold on, guys. I gotta just do this. Oh, come on! drill in the back. Hmm. Yeah, but that one's got the taste for human blood. Oh my god! I just got a message on Twitter that I need to find a sugar daddy in Seattle. 
So, uh, we can have a weekly show where you draw on my head. Yes, I want that. Oh my God, DJ Blue, we could do that. We could totally have a show like, like where I just draw on your head. It's something new every week. And you can wash it off afterwards. Damn, Vanilla, I know. I can't believe it's been six months. That's crazy. Okay, so we got rid of the big old cannony thing. So that's good. I'm just gonna leave the back because I don't wanna do any extra work. Fuck that. That's the most professional neck repair and painting stream I've ever seen. Yes, it should be. You need your fingers for art. You have a drill press. Yeah, but the drill press would do shit for this. Also, that's no fun. It's more fun to do it this way. Like, if it's not difficult, how do you know if it's worth it? Hmm. All right, I might use a Dremel one last time just to smooth this out, because this is a fucking mess. Yeah, I'm gonna do that super quick, guys. I promise I'll be over in a second. All right. Whoa, look at that. See, it melts the plastic. It's like insane. There we go. Perfect. Okay, one last time. Sorry. fit into little boy clothes. <laughs> Today I'm melting shit with Viking last. <gasps> I would love that. That would be a really fun show. Maybe I should do a show where it's melting shit with me. There we go. Okay, cool. So we got him. That, okay, that helped a lot because there were just some bits that were sticking up super, super bad. Um, and luckily since it's a Franken mech, like, they're not gonna be expecting anything too fancy from me. <laughs> Imagine putting the awesome's arm. <laughs> that would be really funny. Should we do that? <laughs> we can put the awesome arm on the hunchback. <laughs> uh, so the Marauder arm literally fits perfectly in here, so, so that's happening. Now we just need to decide what we're doing on the other side. So we do have the arm, what do you guys think? We do have the original arm. Uh, the only thing now would be to like figure out feet. Here we go. So we've got, oh my God. <laughs> that looks so stupid, I kinda wanna do it. Needs more Bondo. <laughs> Today, washing plastic dry with Viking sass, followed by washing blood dry where we follow April to the ER. <laughs> Very nicely put, Mortis. <gasps> Gypsy danger! Five months in a row, resub hard! Thank you so much for your resub to read my show. Dag, dag, thank you for following. You enjoy power tools, I take it. Uh, one of these friggin' have bunny ears. Mm -hmm. Put the awesome legs on for stability. That is actually an idea. You know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. 
Oops. <laughs> well, I just took the torso off. So I, oh, fucking carpal tunnel. I might ask for I ride to come out here and do this for me. Chief armor for Halloween? What? Sorry. Really? Oh my god, Halo Master Chief, dude. Master Chief is like, I don't know. Let's go trick or treating. I just want to be on your arm the whole night. Like, I have such a crush on Master Chief. Oh my god. Anytime I see Master Chief cosplay at cons, I'm like, hi, haha. <laughs> Can I just hang out next to you for a while? <laughs> like, I'm a creeper. Oh my god, dude, I'm so excited about freaking TwitchCon. Yeah, Rai Rai! Rai Rai! I have carpal tunnel and I need help. <gasps> Yay! Oh, DJ Blue, awesome! Ugh. Oh my god, you tweeted it? Oh, I'm gonna have to look at that. Or is it Mora Belorazul? Thank you for following. Okay, thanks. Yeah, I just can't get this leg off because I am weak sauce. Oh, oh, am I? Rai Rai, help me! Help Rai Rai be helping April while she has carpal tunnel guy. Woo. Can you just take this leg off? We're gonna put the, the legs of the awesome. Let me see. This leg? No. Oh, geez, we're doing this. Wow. Special, All right. special child. Boy, it's been a while. Yeah, okay, we're gonna, <laughs> look, we're putting the legs of the awesome on. Look, I got it off. Holy shit. How's everyone feeling about this crazy ass mech we're putting together? This is fun. This is really fun, cause I've never, <gasps> fuck the other arm, let's put this there. Oh my God, yeah. Look at this. <laughs> Arms not needed. <laughs> it looks pretty sweet. Like. My only regret is that it can't just have like a big wheel. Oh my God, yes. Damn, this is actually wait, really hard. Okay, hold on. Let me try this Wait, one. wait, hold on. This, I was putting it. What about this thing? Yeah, use the vice. There you go. Tools. Tools with tools. That's the name of my show. Tools with tools? Yeah. Or just tool with tools. Tool and the tools with the tool. And the whole time I'm actually just uh, doing home, home improvement projects with the band tool. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, yeah. I played tool the whole time. Oh, you did it! Thank you, Rai Rai! Okay, so we're going to check it out. We'll do what? this with this, with the the Marauder arm. We, I, we do have the Hunchback arm, but what's Is this what's is left of the AC-20? Yeah. <gasps> I'm sorry. This is definitely going to get mounted on an Oh my chest. god! I just want to mount it on its own chest. <laughs> that would be too good, then it would have too many guns. Too Can't have many that. guns. Too many guns. <laughs> uh, we could give it like. <laughs> <laughs> or wait, does this fit? Okay, so whatever this is, that's a that's the, oh it's that's this leg. Okay, so we're gonna put the awesome legs on here. Oh my god, look at it! It looks so weird. That's so wrong. Uh, we got the Marauder arm. So let's do. No, upside down one. No, I kind of think that we should go for uh, this. I think this would work very well. Yeah. You can't have too many guns in Battletech. Fuck yeah, Jocko! Jocko knows what's going on. For damn sure. All right, I'm going to drill this hole a little bit just to make it a bit bigger. Mount the HC 20 on its crotch. <laughs> I like that. Sorry, we're doing noise again. Gun go that I want to use. Oh, here it is. 
Yes! Fuck yeah! <laughs> this is great. This is really nice. I enjoy Frankenmacking. Viking Frankenstein. Vikingstein. Okay, so look at this. <laughs> Gonna have that, that, and then two awesome legs. <laughs> This is this is fantastic. I'm sorry, I promise, but I needed it. I needed it. It was necessary. Okay, <laughs> let's fill up. Uh, we gotta we gotta plug those holes real quick. Um, so that's when we use baby powder. Well, beginning is baby powder. Baby powder and super glue. Oh, the Duran method. Bill and Britt taught me this. There's the super glue. Here it is. Woo! Pungent! Catapult missile box arm would be hilarious. burn myself? No, I didn't. Good. That's nice. Emily's still trying to figure something out. It was really, no offense, but it's adorable. She's just so thoughtful. So thoughtful. Emily, how's it going? What's going on? Come say hi. Everyone, come. Hey, Ashley just came in here because I like you. <gasps> she came in here because she likes me. That was pretty much Aww, it. Aw, and I like Emily. Oh, oh. oh I'm so sorry. It's okay. I'm so glad. It smells like babies in here. <laughs> Powdered babies. Powdered babies. Mm. Brought to you by. Brought to you by the Powdered Babies. <laughs> Powdered Baby Company. You've been hanging out with me too much. A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> or not enough. I'm so excited for us to have our bitch and stitch session. Bitch and stitch. Bitch and stitch. It'll be fun. Do you see what I'm doing? But we thing? don't know how to stitch. See, that's the problem. So well, well, it gives us more things to bitch about. About the fact that we don't know how to stitch. Yeah. We'll bitch about not being able to well, stitch. Well, I can crochet. I can crochet too, poorly. Oh my god, we should all crochet together like little old nannies. I want to learn how to cross stitch. I know that Jamesimo does cross stitch. I feel like mm. I would enjoy that. Hmm. I haven't really tried cross stitch in years. Like I think I tried it years ago. I'm gonna stand over here so I can see chat. Okay, yeah, talk. You know what? Can you relate chat back to me? Oh, everyone's saying hi. Relate chat hey back to me. What are you doing, Viking Lots? I am making a Franken mech. Uh, they requested I make a Franken mech for the show this week, so I'm doing just that. Uh, we have. We've got the chassis of a notchback. We got the arm of a marauder. We also got the arm here of other, some other type of mech, I'm not sure what. The crotch of the hunchback, and also the legs of an awesome. It's gonna be awesome. It's pretty cool, actually. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I have like a crazy So where did for... you get this sweatshirt? Target. Okay. Target? The little boy section. Oh, I knew you were gonna say that. I knew you'd say that it was the little boy my, section. My top half is very tiny, mm. in contrast to the large bottom yes. half. The fact that this actually fits over my butt is amazing. <laughs> I don't under like I don't know what shape they think boys are today. Like, can like, I uh, show them something on the webcam really quick? Yeah, totally. You guys, do you realize that this hammer that has we've had for a long time still has Mandy's blood on it? R.I.P. Mandy. R.I.P. R.I.P. Mandy. This is what uh, Rai Rai was using as his weapon on the gauntlet last night. Did you know that we were both on the gauntlet last night? What? We were. Oh. My character was Helga Humongous. <laughs> what does that even mean? Her name was Helga Humongous. Emily, have you had to fight any bears since the other day? Yeah, what the fuck was that about? I got tweets about that. Oh. Oh! There were bears at my house. So I there were multiple bears so in my I'm neighbor's not, yard. I'm not coming over for dinner ever. But you're invited. I well I know they live in my neighbor's yard, not mine. That's too close. They're really cute. <gasps> Thank you so much for the follow, Steins Pizar. Sorry, that was far away. Yeah, we should probably make that larger. I'm gonna move it. 
Thanks, Emily. There we go. Make it funny like you make all kinds of ornaments. <laughs> Full black? Oh, it's a black check arm. Oh, thank you. See, I like how my chat knows what I'm doing better than I do. <laughs> Yeah, so the other day I walk out to go get the mail and I look up and there's a, across the cul-de-sac there are two bears Fuck. and one looks right at me Fuck. and I'm just standing there and I'm just kind of looking at it like, interesting, okay. <laughs> and I'm just trying to observe this bear, hoping it doesn't see me. And then it sees me and it was like this. Oh my god, I'm not. And it started walking towards me, and I was like, no! No! no it did Never not! Mind. Are you serious? But it walked first, towards first you? First, I went and I got my mom, and I was like, Mom, look, there are bears! So we go walk over there, and it it still is just kind of like hanging out. And I'm like, look at it, and we're just kind of like watching. And then it turns around, and it starts to move towards us, and we were like, no, 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 why, no! Why so we walk inside the house you? really quickly and close the door, and then we were like, oh, we left the garage door open! Oh no. <laughs> so we go down to close the garage door, and as I'm watching the garage door close, I see the bear. It's like this. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! no! It, it didn't get like into my driveway or anything, but it was pretty crazy. Oh but my there god. were three of them. Oh my god, were they all three. full grown? No, one of them was the mom and there were two cubs. Oh, that's even that's more even scary. That's even more, yeah, no, that's that's scary. But they're really cute. But what no, I found not. out is that my neighbor uh, enjoys having them there and feeds them sandwiches. That's why it came towards you. Yeah. Fucking neighbors. My neighbor feeds them sandwiches. Your neighbor feeds bears sandwiches. I don't think he like hands it to them, but that would be really cool. Actually, He's the kind of guy that probably would. Yeah. Also, uh, I don't know if you saw the picture on my Twitter account, but he got a picture a couple years ago of one of the bears on um, our tire swing. Are you serious? It was really cute. That was really cute. <laughs> oh. Sorry. Sorry. If I get sorry. Was murdered by a bear or a Wendigo while wearing Offer bears. Water. Yeah. Things with leather and glitter. They'll love you forever. Wrong kind of bear. Did you? <laughs> <laughs> But those kinds of bears are good too. Yes. I prefer those bears than the ones with the big old claws that are gonna kill me. <laughs> Malfoy says my parents have bears in their yard all the time. It's sometimes exciting to take them off the garbage out in the morning. <laughs> what? It's exciting to take the, the, the garbage out in the morning because you never know who you're going to hop in a pond. Oh my god. Like I have to deal with coyotes. Like, yeah, there are coyotes near like, us. I, yeah. I, like I was driving home once at like 3 in the morning and I pull into my driveway and this coyote as big as a fucking full grown German Shepherd just bounds on by. I'm like, okay. Dire wolf! <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was frightening. Okay. Yeah. The bear was just making sure you weren't sit, uh, starting any forest fires. Yeah, I'm sure, Rules. That's exactly what it was. That's exactly what it was, yeah. Um, yeah, we also have... Oh, one time when I was in high school, I woke up in the middle of the night. And I don't really know why I woke up, because it wasn't loud outside or anything. But I woke up, and I peeked outside my window, and there was a whole circle of, like, seven coyotes just, like, standing around in the cul-de-sac. Just hanging out. Have you ever trying seen, to figure out where to go next. Have you ever seen that video of the, the dude who got pulled over by the cop? And the cop's talking to him, and all of a sudden the cop like, looks up, looks over, looks over again, then like runs and gets into the back seat of the car he had just pulled over, and a second later I've got goosebumps. This herd of like 50 coyotes just bolts down the street. What? I need to see this video. Oh my god, I got goosebumps right now. That's crazy. You should get your phone and look it up and have a reaction video right now. That's crazy. I kind of want you to. Has I'm anyone else seen that? that? It's totally on like Winamp and all, or all those like gas okay. sites, Luke. Oh man. Or whatever it's called. Yeah, we had a bobcat in my backyard when I was growing up too. Actually, Aww. there were two. There was like a, a mom and a baby. Aww. That was pretty cute. Yeah. All right, five minutes. Are you serious? Yeah, man. Time flies Damn. when you're having fun. Damn! All right, well, we're, we're getting close to... Ooh. So gloopy. Yeah, well, it's a Frank and Mac, thank God. Frank and so. Mac. So it's gonna look gross. I might... I kind of love it. Me too. This has a... some character to it. Oh, not just some. A lot of character. <laughs> All right, so these are going to dry. 
and um, and we're going to put those other pieces onto to it. Oh, the funniest part about seeing the bears was seeing a bunny see the bears and then run away. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's just like whenever I get home at night, if I see- Because it did the same thing as me, where it kind of like stopped at its tracks, and then like, fuck! Because <laughs> uh, bears eat bunnies. They do, actually. They sure do. Testicle Doom! How are you? Thank you for the bit. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Oh, that, oh yeah. Uh, I need paint, like, black whoa. Paint. I need black paint right. and silver and white. Because the uh, last couple episodes were just black paint heavy. But not <laughs> today has been insane! Oh my god! I was gonna sneeze and then I really couldn't. That was weird. I'm gonna let it go though. I'm totally gonna let that go. In honor of the executioner, maybe one of these mechs should have a giant hammer fist. <laughs> Ooh, Imp, I like the way you think. <laughs> okay. Well, that kind of got. I'm gonna have to. Oh my god, DJ Blue, did you get to hang out with a, pa a Black Panther all the time? Because what? I'm really jealous. It says that his great aunt ran a retirement refuge for the Southern California zoos. Samba the Black Panther, they napped together. I am so jealous. Like, I'm really deathly allergic to cats, but I would give up my life to hang out with a black panther that didn't want to kill me. Oh my god, listen to what he says, I have goosebumps. Rough tongues and a purr that shook me to sleep. Oh my god. Oh, I want to take a nap now. I will be your black panther, baby. <laughs> 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 oh, I like that. <laughs> oh, these episodes are just so short now. They are, but it's good. It's good. I, it's, think, it is, it's, I think it's good because it, it keeps it more action packed. Like, yeah. Like, uh, especially when I have a guest, because like when we have guests on, like um, majority of them are not streamers, so they're not used to going for a long, long period of time. time. And on top of that, so I, I've kind of broken it down. It seems, on average, when I have a guest, 20 minutes of them being like, ah, I'm on camera, uh, then about 45 minutes of they, they're comfortable and they're kind of on a high from it. And then after that, it kind of dips down and that's, about an hour to an hour and a half in. So I think this is like the perfect amount of time, especially yeah. for when I have guests. So I'm thinking, oh, gross. Oh, I touched stuff. Gross. You want me to leave? What? <laughs> Don't you talk to Emily that way. No, I'm just kidding. Watch your mouth. It's fine, it's fine. Ugh. Oh, so much to do. I can't wait to leave for Twitch I know, that's crazy. You're gonna have fun. Are you gonna go to the meetup? What meetup? We're having a meetup. Oh, when? What time? I'd love to. It's on Saturday at 10 a.m. Saturday at 10 a.m. If I'm awake, yes. Yes. <laughs> totally. Totally. Okay, so I'm gonna put these arms and stuff on here super nice. quick just for so you guys. So we can see the Frankenmech? Yeah, just so you can see the Frankenmech in action. Okay, so I'm gonna put it around on this. That's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I feel like Jordan, uh, Jordan Weissman. I feel like Jordan is like, like he's suddenly like something oh. inside. Or he's, he's like, like oh, I just oh. I don't feel right. Something feels wrong. Battletech sense is tingling. <laughs> My Irby senses are tingling. Irby sense is tingling. Look at that. <laughs> okay, and then for this we could just shoot up. <laughs> Oh man. This is so ugly, I love it. I'm not even gonna paint it. I want it to be this <laughs> ugly. I want it to be this ugly. Oh man. Also, I don't have a, I don't have like any time. <laughs> Cause I still have to paint the grasshopper. But this it's is great. This is this is my Looking wishes. Good. These are my wishes. These are the, the wishes of the last. Okay. All right, I'm gonna go help set up for Shadowrun yes. Corporate Sims. Guys, Shadowrun Corporate Sims is coming up next. I am out of time. This is this has been it's been short yet sweet. Lots of fun. I just want to make sure. Yep, QQ's at the computer. Good. Guys, thanks for watching me make a Franken Mac. This has been most fun. You guys are awesome as always. Thank you so much for hanging out. Coming up next, we've got Shadowrun Corporate News, so you can catch up on all the things that are going on in the corporations, which you can be a part of. How do you be a part of them? Sub to the channel! Not only do you get to be a sweet ass thumper with all your thumper emotes, and you get to join the Discord, you get to join one of the corporations and fuck with the Shadowrun people. The Shadowrun game itself starts at 6 p.m., so you'll want to definitely catch that. 
And um, this has been Watching Paint Dry with me, Viking Lass. I've got my own creative stream, so go check that out. You can also follow me at Viking underscore Lass on Twitter, where I sell things. And then also, I'll be at TwitchCon. Come find me. I'll give you hug stickers and butts. Yes, lots of butts. And uh, this has been Watching Paint Dry. And remember, don't eat the paint. Just watch it dry.